guys we we haven't vlogged this morning because we're running late to the airport look hey. mg mg why every time it's a nice car it's an omen or something what's it's a nice car what is mg trying to tell me it, like get a mg get one that's what i'm no, telling you no 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 specifically. mg only turns up when it's like something weird is happening <laughs> No, nothing's weird is happening now. I need things to be good. Weirdly, we are getting there on time and it's fine. Yes, MG must be mm, mad good. Mad good? Yeah. Amazing. M no, mood good. Mood good. It's that's Whenever we see an MG, it's like the universe is saying, no, no, it's all right. Magnifically good. Yeah, magnificently great. good. Everything is ma magnificently great. Yes. <laughs> Caitlin missed her flight. The next one isn't until seven o'clock tonight. <laughs> um, she was crying when she when she rang uh, to tell me, but I just I said, "Yay, that's great!" because we get to we get to spend more time together. And she's like, "Yeah, true. I guess I guess that's true." Caitlin was not as lucky as Grace and I. Apparently, she got to the desk and the plane was still there. The lady was like, no, sorry, you can't get on. You're too late. By two minutes. Positive vibes only, remember. So even though Caitlin missed her flight, we get to spend a full day together. And um, it's it's like a, a hundred and something dollar difference because they'll, they'll put credit towards the next flight. Like they'll just charge a bit of money for the for the privilege of them saying you can't get on the plane that's just sitting right there not going anywhere for the next 45 minutes which is what always happens you know the plane just like sits there um and i've definitely come the wrong way how did i how did i pull this off i was literally the, the airport's there and i drove in a straight line and i thought i'll pull over just in case caitlin misses her flight and now in turning around to go straight back again, I've gotten lost. <laughs> oh, she was sitting on the ground. Oh, she's been crying. Well, um, I've just left Caitlin in the car because she has a few phone calls to make to work and things like that to tell them that she's not coming in today. Um, and we've pulled over at a really, really beautiful location. This is um, sustained, uh, uh, subject to flooding, um, but this is Seven Mile Beach. Look at that, look at the view out there. Doesn't that look incredible? Oh my god. Look at the light shining. Oh wow, it looks so beautiful. Honk. Quack. 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 Where are you, mother clogger? Oh, he's so mad. Oh, don't be mad. Please don't. No, we're friends. I'm, I come in peace. I'm just coming down here. I just want to take pictures by the water. It's fine. I'm, I'm not here to bother you. You're bothering me, actually. No. No, thank you. No. No. Can I take photos of you? Is that a yes or a no? I I'll take that as a yes. Oh, I hear squeaky sounds. Oh, my God, there's a fairy wren. Fairy wren. A fairy wren. Oh, I'm going to get some great photos. So can you just calm down, please? Yeah, have a very angry drink. <laughs> oh, look, there's a good little log that I can use as a tripod. If I put this, see this log? And the duck walked up to the lemonade stand and he said, hey, the man, run in the stand, he said, hey. Got any grapes? Do you have any grapes? Please. Come back. Look, I thrifted these gumboots for this exact reason. Waddle, waddle, waddle. Till the very 
very next day. Now how far can I walk and still stay dry? ran past in athletic wear and they were they're jogging and they're also pushing a pram that is that's commitment to fitness if I've ever seen it I feel so guilty I don't have anything for them look look the duckies cometh the duckies cometh oh no and I don't have anything huh. guests I feel like Bilbo for, yeah, yeah, I feel like Bilbo when all the all the dwarves turned up and he was like, I can't, I can't feed you, I don't have enough food for everyone. And they all just start raiding his pantry. <laughs> oh my lord. This is ridiculous. Hello everyone. I'm, I'm really glad that you could all make it here. I suppose you wonder why I've gathered you here today. You see, Caitlin missed her flight and she's been very sad about it. And I, I just, I called you all here because I thought maybe your cute little ducky faces would make her feel better. So if you could just please continue being cute, it would be greatly appreciated. Uh, she'll be here momentarily. She's, she's uh, just on the phone with her boss. I'm really sorry to hold you all up. I, I appreciate your time. Sorry that she's late, but she'll be here soon. This little guy is sunbathing. Mood. Mood. But also, there's these like pipes that go under this bridge and sometimes the ducks go in under the pipes. So I need to get a photo of that. <laughs> oh, look, that one just came out from under the pipe. Damn it. Oh, I should go get my waders out of the car, but Caitlin's literally talking to her boss and I don't want to interrupt. I guess I'll just wade. <laughs> get it? It's like wait, but wade. Lol. Hello. Well, I'm glad you're happy. She's uh, still going. There she is. Oh my god, look. You can hike up that mountain. Look at that dog. Look at it go. I'm so surprised this duck is still here. It really just does not give two shits. Look how close I am to duck. Duck is right here. Hello, duck. Caitlin, I told my friends that you were sad. So I asked them all to come over. So they're heading, they're on their way now. They're so sweet. Yeah. They're, they're all, they're just, uh, they leave down the road a bit, but they're, they're on their way. They'll, they'll, be here. they'll all be here soon. They're saying, do you have food? Because your friend didn't give us any. <laughs> Are you also standing? Yeah. I, I saw, I was in the car. I saw a lot of black puppeteers. Oh, no way. Lying over there. Seriously? Yeah, it was like 15 minutes ago. They flew all the way over that way. <sighs> So there's a hike. I was watching them and I was like, they were flying really slowly and I was like, you would get a good shot, but I can't tell no. that's happening. It's going to be over by the time I tell you. There's a walking trail, see there? Um, up on the hillside. The lady was walking up there with her dog. I don't know what the view is from the top, but if you'd like to explore, I'm happy to. Okay. have found birds. Maybe. I know that they're there. I saw them. They moved quickly. I lost them. The wrens, right? Yeah, they're tiny, tiny, tiny. Well, that's where they were, you were taking photos of them before in that little oh, area. Here, yeah, so maybe they're just having fun in the little area. They're in here. They just blend in with the pine cones. Funny that. They look the same. It's a nice mob. Yes. Can... Gamers spot the bird. Can you help us at home? Yes. Please pause and spot the bird. <laughs> and then tell me where the fuck it is. Yeah. Oh, I see one up in the sky. Oh, oh. oh no. It's mm. behind the line of the trees. It was the bird. We yeah. must make our way to the summit somehow. We'll have best. Group. I mean, we could just go through. 
It's not recommended. It's called bush bashing for those of you that don't know. I do not. Oh, oh good. No. Oh, good. Fuck, where is he? No, you mother. Oh. Take back inside. Yes, Queen. She's beautiful. Oh, she's singing to us. Oh, goodbye. Oh. Do you think that'll bring them? Uh, in I, the immortal words that. of uh, Alex, uh, do they want some fuck? You want, I got you blue. <laughs> you want yellow? <laughs> Becky, want to smash? <laughs> you reckon I can get down onto this thing? Uh, you can get down. I don't know if I'd recommend it, but you can totally get down. The logs. Yeah, yeah I can. The logs. I can get down. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if you sue me for this, I've got it on camera, right? You got evidence. Why would I don't know, I just like that I have evidence. Ooh. This is what waders were meant for. I'd just be happy that you're sitting down. Yeah, after that walk up. You wanna, you wanna high five me? Oh no, make it back first. Make it back first. I don't think I can. Oh. I think I'm just gonna have to stay here. How unfortunate. It's, right. That's not what I That want. log is not that stable, but. Hey, thank you. Yay. Thank you. <laughs> and a, a high five me. Yes. yes. around on this fucking mountain for hours looking for the summit and we just couldn't find it it's like we, we've been lost in you know, like a studio ghibli film when you like enter the place and you just keep walking in circles and there's no way out that's what it feels like i'm not sure that made any sense but i understand what you said <laughs> so uh turns out this spot that we walked past before that i thought oh that kind of looks like a pathway and we both went nah that, surely that's not a pathway so we kept walking up the the pathway pathway yeah which never ended, so then we came back. Actually, we kept walking that way, and we ended up back here. You know, yeah, we're, we're giving up. This is no, us no, giving up. No, 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 I mean, we walked that way. Yeah. And then we were like, haven't we been here before? Hang on a second. <laughs> like one of those loops. If you th I didn't think that, but... I'm, I'm, I'm making a... You're making a funny? A funny. Oh, sorry. Uh -huh. oh, so it's really good. Anyway, good job. there's I, no I fucking it. pathway here, is there? No, there's not. Come. Definitely not a pathway. To the Alex summit. will demonstrate the path. I'm just going to demonstrate that there is no path to the summit. Oh, no, I have to get in here. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. Oh, is there a path? Oh. What, what, that looks like a path to me. <laughs> well, yeah. What do you think? Do we do it? What if this one also is just an end? <laughs> it's also uphill, but no can now I'm a little embarrassed. I, did, I truly did not think that was a path. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, look, a friend. Friend or foe? Terrifying. I hate it. You don't want to take a photo of it? No. <laughs> I think this is friend. Many people think this is foe. We, so we step, we step over, small friend. We don't have any. In the very least, the birds will think it's tasty. Uh, <laughs> look, there's the sun. Why don't we just go straight up there? Or do you want to go this way? Uh... There's a fence. I see the I edge of the fence I do see the edge there. of the fence. I think maybe we should follow the path. So, um, we're at a point now where the path goes down again. Yeah. But where we want to be is up. I, do, I don't understand. It's literally called One Hill Summit. And we can't fucking find it. I think well, we just go up. We just go up, and then when we hit the fence, we'll go back down again. I, yeah, that just doesn't... Going down is not what we want to do. So, here, let me just move this. I'm glad you brought your mountain hiking shoes. Ah, uh, yes. I was perfectly prepared. Okay. Bush bashing. The Australian way. This is how we get to school in Australia. So if our school is at the top of the hill, we just 
We just walk through the snakes. Yeah, actually, yeah. Very Mark true. Of, it's not a lie. Pro, basically. Oh, it's up there? Go up there then. Yeah. Oh, oh. So there's probably snakes, and there's probably spiders, oh. possibly kangaroos, wallabies. I thought of that. That's a good point. But if you walk where I'm walking, I will step on them. And I have... I might get... Yeah, but I'll, I'll scare them out of the way in the waders, and then it's safe for you to walk behind me. Actually, why don't we follow the paths that the, net, the wild animals have made? There's quite a few of them. See this? This is like a wombat path. And this is not a lie that I'm just saying for Americans. The wild animals follow the same trails and uh... Oh, wow! Yeah. Oh, look at that! That's beautiful. Wait, look at, look at the way that the, the, um, the grass moves in the wind. Well, I found the pathway to the summit. I bet this is a beautiful angle of me. It's glorious. photos of duck. Oh my god. Oh, look at them. Oh, they're running at us. <gasps> Hello, little friends. Hello. Oh, why is my camera switched off? Fuck. Fuck. Oh, you're so cute. They're like, Hello, I'm duck. Please throw bread. Hello. Do not fall in with that camera though, whatever you do. Look at all those chickens. So many chickens. What are you? Soaked. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, my yeah, you are going to be achy. Full of water. What are you going to do, Alex? Hoi. Look at this. Oh, okay. I thought you were about to nail that at the ducks. So, a, a shot I really want to get is one of the ducks going to that pipe there. Oh, that would be cool.
Yeah, he did. Oh, oh he's fussing. lost her. I genuinely don't know where she is. Um. I hope she comes back soon. Though I do have the car keys, so. And I have a, I also have her phone. I also have her phone. Great, good. What is happening here? She's trying to, okay, she's trying to corolla it back from this super deep area. That's what she's doing. I honestly didn't know what the stick was for. I'm a little bit more clued in now. Leg. Oh, uh, maybe. Oh. <laughs> oh, you have an ecosystem in there. Oh, golly. Okay. Well, you got you got your little trophy. You managed it. We're gonna pop this one safely in a towel in the car. Do you have a towel? Um, I've got. I, I have a sweater I can do. I was just thinking that, yes. Uh, you leave the camera rolling the whole time. People can watch. If you ever find a duck with a broken foot that you need to take to the vet, uh, this is what you do. Hold the duck gently. Here's one I prepared earlier. He's very chill about this. He's chill because he's very tired. He's, he's probably, probably very tired. not eaten in a while. And some crazy lady and some waiters just started chasing him down. So he can fly. But flying doesn't help when they're trying to swim to get their food. No, so yeah. dive under the water because he can't. needs his legs to help. Okay, so, the sweater I'm actually going to put over him, oh, over yeah. his body. I'm going to put his little head through it because then his wings will stay down by his side. And they hurt themselves if they flap their wings about. So, oh, just stick thanks. the little head out. Oh. Little pal, hey, here we go. We're going to have to do some Googling and 
work out where you belong, huh? Where you... Do we go to wires? Do we go to... I don't know what... what well, oh, we should message the NPCs, they'll know. I know they've rescued plenty of wildlife. Yeah, they probably have a good shot. Is this not a sign from the universe? You know how I wanted to move down here to start a, like a wildlife sanctuary and rescue? Uh, this is, uh, this only happened because I missed my flight. <laughs> but you missed your flight for a reason. Everything happens for a reason, Caitlin. Uh, but then I wouldn't have gone waiting in with the, like, wouldn't have gone hanging out with the ducks enough to realise he had the heck back. Hey, little duck. Mm. Okay. Okay, can you just wait here, please? Ooh. Can you just wait there? Yeah. And we, we're just going to use Errol's little stool to stop yeah. you moving. Okay, so the wings are nice and tucked in. He's comfy. He's not in there tightly. You know where Brighton is in Tasmania? Uh, Brighton? Oh, God. No. Oh, yeah, what pants are you going to wear? This is the second time in Tasmania I've sat out the back seat of my car with nothing but a bra. <laughs> Some waders? Oh my god, my foot is like suctioned in there. Ready? Oi. Oh. was flying it's just no, that it's his, his left his left leg he can't seem to use his left leg uh my friend's holding him at the moment he can't seem to use his left leg i'll take a photo of him but i'll just i can quickly describe it he's a green-headed duck he's i think he's a wood duck apparently maybe a wood duck i bet wait i've got the book here i can tell you i'll tell you exactly um here he is this is him a chestnut teal certainly Of where we got it with a pretty some some landmarks in it to give you in a good specific area where we are. I don't know. Hey, he's a mallard. Oh. He is a mallard. Apparently, he's definitely a mallard because my friend has a book of birds in her back seat, and he looks like the uh, example image of a mallard. Thanks, Arden. Mm. Uh, I don't think so. I'll do a photo of him, his face first, and then a photo of his legs specifically. Oh, okay. So. Try and lean out if you don't want to get your boobs in it. Nice. Um, maybe do on a different angle. Well, I think that's probably pretty good. Um, I wanted to run outside and take a photo of where he came from with some yeah. landmarks. Yeah. Let me tell you a story, little friend. So you see this ring that I'm wearing? We were at the markets yesterday, uh, the Christmas markets, and um, I said that I wanted a piece of jewellery. And I've been looking for a signet ring for a really long time. The signet ring is in like square on the top. Um, and I, I fell in love with signet rings because Sam's dad has one on his pinky finger that he's had for like 40 years and uh, he's got a really nice sentimental story behind it and uh, I ever <laughs> we started playing 500 you know the card game with Sam's dad so Dan Sam his dad and I and I'm always staring across the table at his hand with the ring on it and I was like I really want a ring like that so when we're at the markets there were lots of jewelers and I thought I'd really like to find a silver ring, a silver signet ring. Um, and we go walking up to this stall and Arden says, oh, hey, these, these guys are really good. Um, I've seen them, you know, heaps before at markets. They've got some really nice stuff. So we go up and the first thing that I see, there's five sterling silver rings and there is one, one single ring that is a signet ring. And I was like, oh my god, there's a signet ring, and I go running up to it. It's got sapphires in it. Sapphires are my birthstone. I was like, oh my god, it's beautiful. This is the ring I've been looking for. And uh, then I put it on, and it fit my finger perfectly. That was, the, that was the finger that I wanted to get the ring for, and it fit perfectly. And then the people that made it said they actually found the sapphires in a river, they're Tasmanian sapphires. And uh, I was like, wow, this this is meant to be. And then I told Hannah, and Hannah was like, you know, signet means like a sign. It's like your your sign in in his throughout history. Whoa, a signet ring was like you would stamp your sign. And 
Anyway, I was like, if, if I needed a sign from the universe that I should stay in Tasmania, it was the fact that I found the ring I've been looking for for literally two years here with my birthstone, and it was the exact same size as the finger I was looking to put the signet ring on. And then Caitlin missed her flight for completely unforeseen circumstances. By two minutes. By two minutes. And that led us to finding this injured duck. And I wanted to move to Tasmania to start a wildlife rescue. I feel like, I feel like all the signs are there. We need to start the car on and turn the AC on and keep him cool. Keep him cool? Yeah. So take him out of the jumper? No, keep him calm. The jumper's probably keeping him a lot calm, but he can overheat really quickly. So okay. if we blast the AC, okay. hold this whole car down, that's good. Well, I need to put some clothes on. Yeah, yeah. she's going to call us back with the place we should be going to. Okay. Um, I saw a few vets nearby as we were driving here, actually. Mm. Gee, but it's windy. I assume the one she's going to be calling will have something about, like, like if there's a cost involved, maybe they'll cover it. Yeah, you, you, or... with wildlife, you don't have to cover it. Where did she say to go? She said something like, my brain's telling me it was Marigold, but I don't think there's a place called Marigold here. It probably is. Sounds like a very it could be Margot place. too. Oh, Mar oh yeah, Mar could it be Margot or Marigold? Margot or... is where near where we were staying. Yeah, but that doesn't mean that's the place that she said to go to. Yeah, it could be any place with a moon on it. In my head, more off sheet. I just heard her go. We'll bring you back with details. I went excellent. So my brain just feel like excellent. So do we just hang out with the duck now? Ah, she said, Sorry, because we can see the whole body. So whole body. Mm -hmm. They want to see a photo of your whole body? Let's show them. Okay, let's get you out of this one. Too hot, huh? It's okay. There we go. And show the wings. So we'll do the front. Very nice. And then I'll turn him around so you can show. Yeah, he can't stand up. It's his left. Definitely his left leg. Hello, uh, mister. I'm really sorry. Come on, we better get him off the Very nice. He doesn't need the sweater actually, he's really calm. Let's keep it there just in case. But... There we go. It's okay. It's alright, really fast. Let's take a selfie. Can you just duck down? Can you just duck your head down, please? Right. Yeah. God, I'm fucking freezing, but we have to have cold air con for the duck. Yeah. Oh my god. Wait. Can I just say? Look at look in the rear view camera. Do you see that puddle? That's from my fucking That's waders. Your puddle. That's my puddle. That's you. All of that has touched you. Alright, Seamus, um, we've arrived at the thylacine. <laughs> you try it. It's not that easy, is it? Litruita. Mm. Litruita. Animal welfare and wildlife hospital. Um, so let's head in. I've got no idea what to expect, but um, maybe I should make some notes because this is the sort of thing that uh, I want to move to Tasmania to create. Oh, actually, one last thing. When we were literally one mm -hmm. minute away, mm -hmm. um, mm. this happened. It's so smelly. This is a hire car. Mm. Oh, um, is it on the car? It's, it's, yep, on it, it's on the seat. Yep. Yeah, and it happened literally as we were pulling in here. I am so glad I'm not here when you return that hire car. <laughs> I think what you mean is you're glad that you're not the one that hired the car. Oh, yeah. And has the uh, $3,000 hold. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Oh, we've had a lovely mess. Yes. Right. <laughs> Let's put you in here. Oh, you have put on the car. Yep, it was quite, yeah. quite the poo. I guess his leg was a little bit ducked up. What do we say to the haters? Duck off. This little guy needs no introduction. Caitlin's been in there for a really long time and she's having a conversation with this person. So that's not the person that picked the duck up. That's a different person. And they keep looking out at the car and laughing. <laughs> who, who is it? Oh, here she comes. <laughs> and now for someone that needs no introduction. Hello. It's Caitlin. The lady was apologizing about the car. <laughs> Oh, what, about the poo? Yeah. Yeah, she should never have done that poo in here, should she? Don't you hate it when people get in your car and shit on your seat? I do, actually. I hate it. Do not <laughs> do it in my car. Sorry, I just... Look how fucking cute that is. Oh, 
that is. That's very sweet. I want to do that. That's adorable. Mm. <sighs> Finally back. I need a shower. And in fact, it will be the first shower I've had in Tasmania. <laughs> it's not a shower. The water pressure is really nice. Okay, good. Good. <laughs>